So I don't typically paint with an easel. So I don't typically paint with an easel. So I don't typically paint with an easel. So I don't typically paint with an easel, but uh, my grandfather passed away not too long ago. I made this easel by hand, so I kind of figured it was a good opportunity to try something new with the easel. Um, this painting is about freedom and darkness and jet skis. So eventually what I hope to see are a lot of hot green chicks on jet skis down here. Maybe a banner, something that says something about freedom. And then some sketches of what the babes of summer should look like. So then I even been playing around with the composition a little because I want the jet skis to be in just the right area, the scale. So uh, I'm just going to go ahead and start. I'm just going to go ahead and get right in there. This is typically how I work. Really small brush. Just take my time. That's probably enough for now. Just, I'm going to kind of dwell on that, on the marks that I made. And um, just kind of think about what I've done, the composition, where I want to go with this thing. So this part right here, this might be enough for the day just to kind of get me to the next spot of where I want to go with this painting. So I've got about 225 pounds on here. It looks like 90, but it's really 225. Harley's here to spot me, my dog. One, two, four, five, seven, ten. Stare to paint time to pumping iron time, because they're all related. I will, I'll make a mark. I'll look at it, I'll pump some iron, maybe do 10 reps, come back, if the paint's dry, maybe make another couple marks if it's wet, I'll kind of walk away for a while. So I can stare at something, I can stare at something for an hour.